Okay, today is December 5th, 2019, and I was out of the, oh, this is a Colombian restaurant. Oh, I can't even get the sign from here, but it's where I brought the uh, flags earlier for sale. I hadn't heard back from them yet, so I doubt if they sold any, but I decided to make a different design. Charge a little more for these. These I sold for 10 the others were going for 6 so we'll see if these move any faster. Um, got one for India. I'm going to a, 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 a restaurant. It's run, I believe, by an Indian gentleman. He, he, we're friends on Facebook now. He uh, had a birthday recently, so I'll bring this off as a birthday present to the one of the owners. And um, see if that gets me into that community. Also, I made this for Dallas Spurs. I put my information on the bag. So they're having a, I went on Facebook and found out they're having a Christmas party. So uh, I made that, um, messaged them on fa Facebook. I still haven't heard back from them yet. So I'm about to go up there and drop it off. Uh, the party's this Saturday. So just get it in somebody's hands and we'll see what happens. I'm still waiting to hear back from the other group, the, um, the Arsenal group. Um, they put it out on Facebook. So we'll see what happens. They have a game today. So maybe I'll, I'll hear back from him soon. Also, I heard back from uh, the newspaper, uh, uh, a community group in uh, Cedar Hill. They're going to do a story about my dealings with the um, uh, England, CR England Trucking Company. I haven't heard back from him yet. So I sent him a, a message a couple of months ago, and he hasn't responded. I thought he would have put place another order by now, but you know maybe he's he's busy or whatever. But this article. It's coming out just to talk about uh, what he's doing there, and hopefully this will kick kickstart our relationship. If not, you know, it was good while it lasted, and it's, it'd be a nice way to say goodbye to him, uh, and doing something positive on my end. Uh, the rent got paid, so you know, it took a lot of things to come together. <laughs> Mainly the job from uh, uh, Rainbow Vomit, got that done, and uh, some tip money, so it worked out. Um, what I learned from this whole experience is I got to do better with my finances. I got to make sure the rent gets paid because there's a certain way people talk to you when they, when you owe them money, and a certain way you can talk to people when you don't. So it's it's interesting because they talk to me a certain way, and then, I, and then when I need my copy of my lease to get um, to check on the late fees. Uh, they were slow on that. So it's interesting because, like, when they needed their money, they would track me down. When I needed a lease, I got to chase them. So I realized it's better to chase somebody who owes you something than being chased by someone you owe money to or owe anything to. So it just kind of opened my eyes up, like, you know what? I need to do a better job saving my money. So I get paid this Friday. My plan is to keep between $200 and $150 set aside. I can't even touch. So, and then build on that to get the rent. The rent's only six, $650 a month. But <clears throat> I need to do a better job of, of doing it. And that's the reason I didn't move, because you can't find a place in Dallas, you know, for $650 a month. And not that size. It's a nice size apartment. It's really more apartment than I need. Um, so I'm, I'm holding on to this good location. I'm right next to the laundromat. It's like, you know what? It's close to, you know, where I, where the, you know, the maker space and um, not too far, too far from the airport. So it's, it's. It's, it works out. It's pretty convenient for me, so I'm going to stay there. So I'm going to drop these off, then I'm going to work. It is 1 o'clock now. I plan to be to work by 4. So um, I think that's it. Oh, TCU might be on hold because um, I don't have a license. So um, the Dr. Um, Higgins is checking in on that, see if there's a way we can get around it. You know, maybe it work, maybe it won't. But um, also, a friend, uh, Chris asked me to do a flower for his uh, someone in his family who passed. So I'm working on that. Um, I'm looking for a way to get into the the whole funeral industry, the grief industry. Um, so I'm really trying to make something very nice for him that maybe I can um, uh, put out to some other people. But um, I got to get his taken care of. He needs that by Tuesday. Uh, so that's kind of the main things that are going on now. Um, still heard, haven't heard back from Lexi V. I don't know what's going on. So hopefully I'll hear back from them soon. But if not, I got to keep 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 it moving. Right, I'm gonna drop these off and.